Usual multi grain wheaty pops. I'm not surprised. Why is that? It's bird seed. Bird seed? What are you trying to do? Turn me into a budgie? You'll be getting me worms next. <laughs> worms. The very idea. The thing is, we're a bit hard up. <laughs> I don't know. At this rate, I'm going to be losing weight. Oh, and another thing. We're all out of biscuits. <laughs> Not to worry. I'm not over keen on biscuits anyway. Are you the winner of this week's Jumping Jackpot? If so, bring a winning ticket to HQ by 12 noon today. £50,000 is waiting for you. Watch closely. Is this you? Look at that. Some idiot's non... Hang on. That's Barry. Barry's won. Barry! Barry! Yes? Uh, nothing. Okay, then. I've won. I've won fifty thousand pounds. All I need is a ticket. <laughs> Two hours to go. Uh, I've won. I've won. I've won. I've won. What you say? Um, uh, I said a bun. A bun. I need a bun. Oh, I'll see if there's one in the kitchen. Yeah. I must look for it. I must find the ticket. Find the ticket. <laughs> must find it. Must find it. Must find it. You really do want a bun, don't you? More than anything I've ever wanted in all my life. Where is it? Where is it? Why didn't you ever lie down? It must be the hunger. No. Hang on. Why am I searching all the cupboards and drawers? You've got it, haven't you? Hey, come here, let's have a look. What are you doing? Come here, to me. Get on. Come on, come on. Come back, come back here. Come back. Come here, you. Hey. Right, right. Where is it? Where have you put it? Where's the ticket? Ticket? Uh, cricket. Bat. Cricket bat? I thought you wanted a bun. The winning ticket was bought on Floribel Street last Wednesday. So Floribel Street? Get down the head That's where I bought my ticket. Barry, um, you know you've always said what's yours is mine. OK, if you say so. Do you mind if I have that in writing? Hey, I've won! I've won the jumping jackpot! Nonsense. I'm rich. Rich beyond my wildest dreams. You're right, we're rich. Where's the ticket? Let me think. I've no idea. You stupid! We've wasted a quarter of an hour. There. That's everything out of the house. Now, the only thing left in there must be the ticket. Barry, bring it out. <laughs> We're going to be rich. That's not the ticket. I know. I've had a thought. Whenever I take a library book out, I use the jackpot ticket as a bookmark. Brilliant! Where's your library book? I took it back to the library. There's nothing to worry about. We'll just go in the library, find the book, open it up and get the ticket. <laughs> it's five to eleven. That gives us an hour and five minutes. Now, what was the title of the book? Bobby Fandango, Space Detective. Great. Or was it Seymour Wilson, Underwater Agent? What? Oh, no. It could have been Colin Butterworth, Jungle Assassin. Oh, dear, oh, dear. Come on. I remember now. Matt Flash, Psychic Spy. Shh. Sorry. Now then, uh, spies. Spies, spies, spies. There it is. Somebody's got it. I wouldn't read that book if I was you. I don't want to spoil it for you, but uh, the mermaid's a double agent. Thanks a lot. We're rich! We're rich! <laughs> <laughs> hey, he's not there. Oh dear, it's the wrong book. I forgot to tell you, in the Matt Flash series, there are 98 volumes. Huh? There's only one thing for it.
start shaking. Not like that, the books. Oh. Gentlemen, do you mind? <laughs> what are we going to do now? You don't have to stack the books, you know. We have staff to do that. Oh, we're not stacking them. We're taking them out. How many books have you got there? Uh, one, two, three, ninety-eight. You can't take out ninety-eight books on one ticket. Well, how many can we take out? Five. Ah, no, the ticket's not here. Let's go and get another five. <laughs> another five, Barry. We finished with those. You've read those already? Oh, yes. We're speed readers. Yeah, when I read Round the World in 80 Days, it only took 40. Oh! Bringing those back. Another five, please. Ah, da, 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 da. I'm sorry to say, gentlemen, you've reached your weekly quota. <laughs> hmm. Don't worry, Barry. Nothing chucks a stopple. I mean, stops a chuckle. to take out these five books, please. We do like a good spy novel, don't we, Mabel? Yes, we do, Edna. So if you wouldn't mind stamping them with your shiny little stamp, we'll be on our way. You must think I was born yesterday. Get out of my library or I'll call the police. You can't talk to me like that. I'm 87 years old now. Oh, oh forget it. Come on, buddy, let's go. No, that's it. The name of the book. Matt Flash and the Secret Police. <laughs> What are you laughing at? Matt Flash and his secret police was taken out... Oh, not five minutes ago. Well, who took it? What did it look like? T -t 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 let me think. I've got a dreadful memory, you know. Come on, tell us, or we'll... We'll, um... We'll mess your paper clips up. <laughs> five eleven dark hair, grey suit. <laughs> that's better. Uh, Daddy, mess them up anyway. <laughs> Can't have gone far. 20 past 11, 40 minutes to go. There he is, look! <laughs> Help! My brother's being attacked by a wasp. You don't know if you've got anything to swat it with, have you? Preferably a book. Oh, look, that one'll do. <laughs> oh, that are you all right? What happened? I accidentally swatted you with the book. Are we rich? Oh, not exactly, no. Oh, dear. There he is, look. Hey, he's moving house. That ticket might end up in Australia. We'll never get there in half an hour. We've got to get in there. Yeah, follow me. Remind me when it's your birthday, will you? What for? I'm going to buy you a proper bookmark. Oh, you check out the mantelpiece. <laughs> oh, oh, what was that? Um, what was what? Haven't I seen you two somewhere before? Uh, yes, first thing this morning, when we start to move your furniture. Well, I have to be at work at 12 o'clock. You will be careful, won't you? There are a lot of valuables in this room. Oh, 25 minutes. Here, check out that box. Hang on. What happens if he's found the ticket and he's put it in a safe? You're right. Safe, safe. Ah. Some people hide safes behind pictures on walls. How do you know that? Just a hunch. Ah. No, no, it's not there. <laughs> oh, de oh. You stupid thing, oh. now that we have done... Oh. Oh, no! 24 minutes! Got to find the book! Oh. Find the book! Find the book! Find the book! Find the book! Where's the book? Hey! I've got it! What? I've got it! Ah! Ah! Yeah. Oh. Oh, after it! Oh. Have you got it? He's gone inside. Oh. 
grass torn it. What are we going to do now? Well, I'm not going to let 50,000 quid just out of my grasp like that. Follow that sofa. Well, can you look? Not exactly, no. What do you mean? My arm's stuck. You aren't. Mate. Here we are, the jumping jackpot headquarters. We're almost there. Ooh, three minutes to go. Right, get this thing inside, then we can get that wretched ticket out. Right. This is no time to rest. Sorry. Find the ticket, and this time don't get stuck. It's no use, I can't find it. Wait here. Where did you get that? Two liar shop next door. Now stand back. Sparks are gonna fly. <laughs> oh! I got it! Oh, great! 30 seconds to go. Ring the bell, Barry. Shop! We've come collect our 50 grand. <laughs> I can't wait to see his face when he sees us, eh? <laughs> <laughs> it's him. You. What are you doing here? Um, we've come collect our 50,000 pounds. Would that be my sofa by any chance? Possibly. We're very sorry. We'll pay for all the damages. Well, gentlemen, everything seems to be in order, so that's £50,000. <laughs> Minus, of course, the cost of my sofa. <laughs> was it expensive, then? Oh, no, 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 no. The sofa was hardly worth anything. <laughs> oh, all right. No, it was the rest of the stuff that was priceless. Hmm? One Georgian ceramic Pekingese. Oh, that old rubbish. Ten thousand pounds. What? And an oil painting, Monkey at Sunset by Florence Fawcett. Thirty-nine thousand pounds. <laughs> Leaving you, gentlemen, with one pound. A pound? One measly pound? What can you get for a pound? Tell you what, you could buy another ticket. <laughs> There's nothing like Colin Ibbotson. He went to school with you. He did. It could have been Colin Butterworth, jungle assassin. 